Check it out guys, it's Trevor James. We just got into Calcutta, India, and today we're going for a full on street food tour. I am so pumped. Let's go check it out. This is it, Kolkata. A street food heaven with food so good, it's almost like a dream. And as soon as you arrive, you're bombarded with a huge selection of delicacies that would take a lifetime to discover and an energy unlike any other city in the world. This is part one of five of our Kolkata Street Food series. So make sure to watch this whole video and keep going in the playlist as well to bask in the true glory of Kolkata Street Food with us. And today we found six amazing street foods. So let's eat. Look at this guys, right across the street there is a busy tea stall. We're gonna get a sabsi curry and a kachuri. Let's try it out. Ekle sabsi kachuri. Ek, ek chai. Oh, look at this, guys. Oh, that's a, oh, beautiful. Alu. Look at this. We just got a sabzi, which is potato curry, and oh, here's the kachuri. The little puffs of joy. Ah, oh, beautiful. Oh, that's a big breakfast. Thank you. Oh, I think that's paneer. Paneer. Just putting some paneer on there. And we're gonna get a chai tea as well. Oh. Oh, chili. Chili. Awesome. Spicy. <laughs> and look at this massive pot of chai that we're getting in the back here. Oh, that's huge. Wow. That is incredible. The smell coming from that is just amazing. This chai tea is just insane. Sugar. Sugar. It's good. Look at that incredible. That is a lot of sugar. Oh, it's, it's chai. Amazing. This smells. It's saffron. Saffron. And right down here, they are preparing the fresh kachuri. And there is cumin seeds in there, rolling it out, and he's putting, he's gonna put it in the oil. And that is what we're gonna have with our sabsi potato curry. Beautiful. So we just got a beautiful chai tea here in a clay cup. And then we also have potato curry with a bit of paneer and then the kachori, little, little fried puffs of goodness and some fresh chili. Let's go try it out. Look at this guys. Chai tea in the morning, it doesn't get any better. And he put some beautiful saffron flakes on there. Oh wow, that's good. That's really good. That is actually a very strong, it has a very strong black tea flavor, but also a strong spiced goodness in there. That is a deep spiced tea in a clay cup. That is so satisfying, beautiful. And then we're just gonna take this kachori, nice warm kachori in the morning. Looks like some black sesame. It's like a, it's like a fried flower ball with some, might be some cumin seeds in there as well. Oh yeah, warm potato, look at that. Warm potato curry with paneer cheese. Beautiful. Mmm, that just feels powerful, healthy, spicy. 
and you can see all the potatoes, the chickpeas, the paneer cheese. There's a dried chili in there, and it's on a big bay leaf. And I'm, I'm pretty sure that's increasing the flavor profile. Awesome start to the day. This city is just full of life, full of food. It is packed with energy, and we are on the hunt for more. I think we just got stuck in the middle of the road, but this gives you an opportunity to see the real heart, the real soul. You've got these classic, almost heritage-like cabs, yellow cabs, and blue buses. I don't think you can see that in many other places in India. It really is. It really does have a classic feel to it here. This is what dreams are made of. With five more street foods planned to eat, we took a quick walk to the new market area to hunt and warm up with a bel puri, aka puffed rice with a spicy mango chutney. This is to die for. We are going to new market area now. We're gonna find more street food, and then we're gonna have a famous Calcutta street food, the roll. I can't wait to try it out. We are gonna get bel puri here. Look at that puffed rice, beautiful. And then look at what he's adding here, lots of crispies. Oh yeah, crispies, peanuts, some chickpeas, cilantro, onion. Oh yeah, look at this. That is garam masala, I think, some salt. And uh, look at this, oh wow. That is a chutney, I think that's a mango tamarind chutney. Beautiful, oh, looks good. Oh, and a coconut. It's looking good. Nice. This looks absolutely delicious in Kolkata. Oh, Kolkata street food. And coconut. Yeah, coconut. Coconut, cilantro, coriander, wow. and chili. Thank you. We just got the bell puri. Look at all the delicious stuff that he just put in here. There's chickpeas, peanuts, and the real secret. Look at here. This is the chutney. Oh, mango chutney. Mango, tomato, tamarind. It looks spicy and sour. Oh, and lime. Mango, chutney, lime. Beautiful. And that is in our bel puri. Puffed rice, crispy rice, street food in a newspaper. It's like a crispy street snack from heaven. Oh yeah, look at the chilies and the onions. Oh, the chickpeas, peanuts. Let's try it out. Mmm. Wow. Oh, it's good. Oh, thank you. It really is all about that chutney that is spicy and sour. Oh, thank you. It's good. Oh, wow. It's good, yeah. That's all about the chutney. It definitely has a spicy kick, very spicy. You can taste a bit of a mango flavor in there as well. Oh, that is an instant hit of spice. The chili, the chutney, spicy, sour, fresh, and crispy. That is true heaven. Now we're getting warmed up. Next up, we walk just a few steps down the street to try Kolkata's most famous street food, the roll. You have to see this beauty to believe it. Next up, we're gonna go for a famous street food here in Kolkata, the roll, the Kusum's roll. Hi. Yes. Egg double egg chicken roll, please. Egg double chicken roll. Double egg, yeah. Single egg, double chicken. Uh, double egg? Double chicken. Single chicken. Or double chicken, sure. So this is the famous Kusum's roll. Beautiful. Here, here it goes, guys. Famous Kusum's roll. So, so he's making a hot maratha right now. He's put some Oh, he's just put an egg on. He just put two eggs on there. This is the double egg Kusum's roll. It's like there's an omelet on top of the burrata. Oh, beautiful. Mm. 
Look at that. That is marinated chicken with onions. I believe that is fried in capsicum. That paratha with the egg. That is one of the most that is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. A little bit of onion. Lemon. Lemon. Black pepper. Black pepper. One sauce? Yes, uh, yes please. Tomato. Tomato. Tomato sauce. Nice. Yeah, chili sauce. Chili. Chili and chili sauce. Yes, please. One green chili? Yes, please. Just a little. Oh, beautiful. Green chili. Nice. Beautiful. Look at this, guys. That is the hot kati roll at Kusum's. There is chicken. The paratha is just soaked. It's just fried in that egg. You can see the onion and the chicken is fried in a tomato sauce with capsicum. Oh, pepper, masala spice. And that paratha is crispy. It's like there's an omelet on that paratha. Mm. Wow. Wow. That is really good. Wow. That is unlike anything I've ever tasted. It is so flavorful. It's all about the marinade in the chicken. You can taste that it's marinated in yogurt and spices. Oh, the onion aroma, slightly sweet. There is definitely a slightly sweet, peppery, spicy goodness in there. In that crispy, oily paratha, that is true, deep down satisfaction. Just add a little lime on there. You can taste that lime. The lime and the chili, they go together like nothing else. After that beautiful roll, we made our way to one of Kolkata's most iconic street food heavens, Decker's Lane. Before continuing through Kolkata for an incredibly flavorful biryani and curry feast that will make your mouth water. Here in Decker's Lane, the locals sit down and enjoy a huge selection of street foods for lunch and dinner, with the famous selection being a flavorful chicken stew and toast. Decker's Lane. This is it. Street food mecca. Oh, noodles. Hi. Egg plate, chicken stew, egg bread. Thank you. So there is toast and chicken stew and tea. Look at this, we're gonna get a chicken stew. Party healthy chicken stew with some toast. Oh yeah, nice. And some toast. Oh yeah, some pickles, some cucumber and onion with some pepper. Beautiful, thank you. Look at this, guys. It's like a chicken soup, chicken stew with potato, carrot, lots of pepper. Oh, it's hot. It's hot. Oh. Beautiful. Oh, tender chicken. And I am just gonna put a little bit on that bread, and then I'm gonna dip that bread into that nice, nice soup. Oh, it's crispy. Mmm. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. That's like a super aromatic, very clear chicken chicken soup. It's quite light. It's very peppery. I've been dreaming of coming here for so long. Now we're finally here tasting the peppery soup. This peppery stew truly is a dream come true to come here. If you come to Calcutta, come eat in Decker's Lane. Next up, look at this. Look at this, guys. Right up here, beautiful. Juice bar. Hello, hi. How are you? How are you? Man? Can uh, egg masamdi juice? Huh? No ice. One masamdi. What's up, masamdi? No ice, please. Look, look at this, guys. This is the juice bar heaven. Lots of juice. Wow. Looks good. Is this masamdi? Mango lassi. Mango lassi. Okay. We have mango lassi. We're also going to get an orange juice. No ice. Masamdi. Okay. Thank you. Mm. Oh, that is fresh. Not too sweet, actually, just very fresh. 
Feels good. To finish off this amazing day of street food, we had one of the most delicious biryani and curry meals in the world at Arsalan Biryani Shop, downtown Kolkata. And to get there, you can jump right into a heritage Kolkata taxi and enjoy the ride. All right, let's go check it out. We are in the classic heritage Kolkata taxi. We're on the way to go to a huge, huge feast. It's gonna be really good, and it has been an amazing day in Calcutta so far. Mind blowing. We are here, we're gonna have a big feast at Arsalan. Oh, hello. Wow, what are these? Mutton chop. Mutton chop. And this? Chicken chop. Look at this. This is the most incredible looking simmering mutton curry. Oh, it looks so juicy. And then over here, they have the chicken chop. Oh, and these massive pots of joy in the city of joy. Oh. I think we just found the jackpot. Apart from these chops, there is also kebab in the back. In the back, there is mint chutney kebabs. There is your regular kebabs, all for the tandoor oven. This is true heaven. We're gonna go in the back and take a look. Look at these massive cauldrons. Oh, oh this is the mutton the biryani. Mutton salam biryani. Wow. The potato is here. Oh, wow. Look at this intensely aromatic biryani. You can smell the cardamom. Yeah, yeah, yeah cardamom. Cardamom. Yeah, very important thing is famous is the cardamom. It looks so good. It's so fragrant. Yeah, a lot of burani is there. The little soup made hot. Oh, it's so fresh. Yeah, the fresh one. Beautiful. All time makes the fresh. So mutton biryani is very famous here. Yes, and you've been big all in the restaurant as well. A Calcutta specialty. Looks so good. Here's the chicken biryani. Yeah, the chicken is there. Oh, nice. The braised piece, the chicken braised. It's layered. Uh, yeah, yeah. This was the braised. Oh, you can the see. One. Yeah. You can see the layers yeah. in there. This was two pieces on the chicken, one the leg on the braised. So fresh. Yeah, this is all fresh. Oh. Yeah. Beautiful potatoes and chicken. And look at this mutton over here. This really looks to die for. Big chunks of mutton. Nice potatoes, basmati rice, and you can smell. You can just smell that cardamom. It looks so good. And now we're getting a look at the curry. Yeah, this is a mutton kasa. Mutton kasa. Yeah, this is the mutton kasa. It's so important. This oil is uh, showing the of zafa. This is oil. Oh, it looks so it's, rich. Uh, sunflower oil, you know? Sunflower oil. Sunflower oil. oil. Yeah, sunflower oil. Chicken butter masala. Chicken butter masala. And you're just making all the chicken butter masala. All the boneless pieces there. Boneless yeah. butter masala. All boneless. Beautiful. Uh, this chicken Iran is too. It's the same thing. This is just this chicken, that one's the mutton. Just chicken. Just chicken. And the uh, spice. Oh, lots of spices. Yeah, spice, the garlic, the green chili, red chili, the black pepper. Oh, wow. Uh, the mutton irani stew, that's the same. This is chicken, that one's a mutton. Oh, okay, chicken irani and the mutton irani stew. Yes, right. The made for the ginger, the red chilies, the black pepper. Oh, wow, they're so thick. This is the ginger. Ginger? Yeah, and red chilies one. Thank you very much for the introduction. Beautiful. Okay, thank you. Incredible. Speechless with the amount of selection here. Thank you so much. Look at this beautiful, mind blowing feast in Kolkata. We ordered some beautiful dishes here. We ordered seven special dishes straight from heaven. Starting with the true specialty, the mutton biryani packed with spices and cardamom and potatoes and juicy pieces of mutton that melt in your mouth. We got an amazing mutton chop, ground mutton in a spicy curry, and a creamy and smooth butter chicken masala marinated in yogurt and masala spices, a specialty Arsalan kebab covered with cheese and baked in a tandoori oven, a super thick and potent mutton rogan josh with incredibly tender chunks of mutton and garnished with cilantro. It also came with a mint chutney, and to finish it all off, we got a super fluffy and crispy mutton keema stuffed naan coated with butter and ready for scooping up delicious curries. This is true curry heaven. This is truly what dreams are made of here. I dream about food like this. This is gonna be life changing. I'm really gonna go, I really wanna go for that beautiful mutton rogan josh. Oh, 
That is truly flavorful. That is a universe of flavor right there. That is pure flavor. It's actually not too spicy. It's just, it's quite rich and it's deep. It is complex. It is a complex flavor. You can tell they put a lot of spices in there. Turmeric and garlic and all oh, the cilantro on top. This is incredible with the butter naan. This here is true heavenly curry. Something spice lovers will rejoice in on their first bite and reminisce on after their home. The biryani was packed with cardamom and worth the flight alone to India. And the cheese covered chicken kebabs were so rich with a salty cheese and a smoky and tender kebab that just melts in your mouth. Very heavy and cheesy and so addicting. And the flavors here are just absolutely to die for. This has been some of the best food of my life in Kolkata. I would love to hear from you in the comments below. Please click that thumbs up button and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Also click the little notification bell so you can get updates for these deep street food tours. This is part one of many Kolkata street food tours and I can't wait to see what else we can find. Thank you so much for watching.